G'day. Consider the global opportunities in an uneven recovery. Third and final day of our little discussion about opportunities. And today, I want you to think about how the recovery from this COVID-19 crisis is going to be unevenly distributed across the world. Just as we went into this crisis at different times, stages and levels of intensity, so too we will come out of it that way. We're already seeing it right now. And in that creates the opportunities because you can look and see what's happening in those countries that are recovering quicker and learn the lessons from that and the products and services that are in demand potentially and apply that learning to the opportunities in your own country as you start to recover and get to that level of recovery. Because if you think about how we went into it, I remember being in Melbourne back in February last year, just as things were really intensifying in China, and all the talk then was about the Chinese people buying up all of the toilet paper and uh, a rice even, and face masks and rubber gloves, and sending them back to China. And at the time, everybody was sitting back laughing at that, saying this just is, is crazy. Of course, fast forward a few months later, and then everybody, it would seem in Australia, was in the supermarkets hoarding all of those same things. And so had you seen what was happening in China and anticipated that might happen in your country in Australia, you could be ready to leverage that. Now, you can do it in a negative way and try to exploit people and then start overcharging and hoarding for products and then overcharging to sell them, which a lot of people did. Or you could take the other approach. You could say, well, I can see that these face masks are becoming an issue. I'm going to start to become an expert on face masks, start publishing as much content on face masks as I can. And I'm going to get as much of a supply of face masks as I can, and I'm going to sell them at the normal rate. I'm not going to try and sell them at inflated prices. And then I'm going to establish brand value by being not only a, a source of knowledge on the product, but also as a fair and reputable guy selling it at the right price. So that's the opportunity going into the crisis. There will be similar types of opportunities coming out. And as I said, it's either learnings from other countries that you can apply in yours or things that you can do potentially, products and services, knowledge, that you can export to other countries as they hit your particular level of recovery. So there's a massive opportunity there today. That opportunity will continue as long as the recovery continues. So most of 2021, there is a massive opportunity there for you, I think, in looking at the global opportunity in the uneven recovery. Alrighty, that is it for today. I do thank you for your time, and I will be back again tomorrow. See ya.